take one. Action. Happy Tuesday, Dolphins. I'm Amelia. And I'm Lucy. And this, and this is, is the WNTE, WNTE News. News. Today's date is Tuesday, January 24th. Today is school day number 86. Did you know that the Empire State Building in New York City has an observation deck on the 86th floor? I didn't know that. I bet the view of the city is amazing from up so high. Let's check out today's birthdays. There are no birthdays today, Dolphins. It's time to stand for the Pledge of Allegiance followed by our swim pledge. You I, play a, I pledge allegiance to the flag of the United States of America and to the republic for which it stands, one nation, under God, indivisible, with liberty and justice for all. I pledge to be safe, well prepared, in control, and to make respectful choices. You may be seated. Now in school news, we have another news crew interview. Hi, I'm Kaylin, and today we're interviewing fifth grade student Lucy Washburn. Hi, Lucy. What's your favorite part about North Topsail? I love all the teachers that work hard to keep us educated, and I love seeing my friends every day at school. That's very cool. Do you do any, any interesting outside of school activities? I do news crew, and I also do tennis. That's very interesting. Back to you, anchors. Are very proud to announce our North Topsail Science Fair winners. Their projects were Apples versus Substance by fifth graders Maddox Coleman, Rebecca Schweitzer, and Amelia States. The next one was the What's That Powder Project by fourth graders James Withers and Spencer Blask. And another project, The Wonderful Nature of Flowers by Amelia Brown, Malia Bruce, and Micaiah Lamar. And congratulations to Maddox, Rebecca, and Amelia, who were selected for the Pender County Schools District winners. They will have the opportunity to move on to the state competition in the upcoming weeks. Way to go, Dolphins. Today we are here with Kenny Bonello, the super swimmer of Miss Valdensi's class. How do you, can you be a super swimmer? Because I can show my friends to be quiet when my teacher said so. That's very true. And what's your favorite part about school, Kennedy? I love I love playing with my friends. Back to you, anchor. Ryan Erskine. How do you be a super swimmer? Uh, when your teachers tell you to do something, you have to do what they say. What's your favorite part about North Topsail? Uh, my teachers. Back to you, Wayne. Today we are here with the new superintendent of Pender County Schools, Dr. Breedlove. Good morning. Thanks for having me. We have a couple questions to ask you. What is your role as a superintendent? All right, as a superintendent, I oversee the school system. Uh, you know, much like a CEO and, and any other uh, corporation or organization. Uh, my job is to, yeah, is to oversee uh, our organization, which is Pender County Schools. And I get to work with our principals. I get to work with our teachers. I, I get to work with students too. So uh, unlike maybe some other CEOs, I have a lot of fun uh, in my job because I get to go into schools to see all the great things that are happening. So uh, yeah, it's a, it's a fun job. I would recommend it to anyone, all right? And uh, hopefully uh, one day uh, I will see some of our students jumping into education and moving in that direction. Okay. And since you recently moved to Pender County Schools, what is your favorite thing so far? The people, all right? The students, uh, the faculty, the staff, the administration that I get to work with. Everyone has been so warm and so welcoming on every everything that everywhere I've gone and everything I've done. 
It's just the people have been fantastic. And what is a fun fact about you that you think other people should know? All right. Well, um, if you ask my daughter and my son, they think that my hobby is cleaning. So uh, I think that's kind of funny. I don't think my hobby is cleaning. I like golf. I like fishing. I like exercising uh, and doing uh, other fun stuff besides cleaning. But they say that I'm a, I'm a good cleaner. Thank you for your time. And back to you, anchors. It's time for our joke of the day, which comes to us on National Peanut Butter Day. Why did the girl smear peanut butter on the road? I don't know. Why? To go with the traffic jam. Get it? <laughs> and finally, we will leave you with this. We have been given the gift of a great memory. Put that memory to good use. Let's make it a great day, dolphins. I'm Amelia. And I'm Lucy. And let's swim to success. Just, just keep, keep swimming, swimming, just keep swimming, just keep swimming. Bye, dolphins.